This is the HC127 hole cutter for pipes. It's purpose designed for quickly and easily creating holes in pipes of various materials. It's fully compatible with European Union CE, CB, and EMC standards. Its design ensures that the hole will be perfectly centered and square to the pipe. This makes it an excellent tool for preparing for welded or mechanical tees for plumbing, industrial maintenance, or fire safety work. The vinyl rests on the pipe and the two chain clamps hold it securely. The chains engage in the notches. The two swivel level screws ensure a tight fit. The standard chains allow clamping pipes from about one and a quarter inch up to eight and a quarter inches, which is 32 to 203 millimeters. We have optional chains available which can clamp up to 24 inches or 600 millimeters. The four column suspension ensures that the machine stays square to the pipe for straight and centered holes. The 1100 watt motor delivers plenty of torque for large holes. It has a 5 8 or 16 millimeter drill chuck which holds TCT or bimetal hole saws for drilling on a variety of pipe materials. It can drill holes up to about 5 inches or 127 millimeters. The collapsible top handle is a unique design that helps with both carrying and placement on the pipe in any position while not adding to the height of the machine. The switch can be operated by feel as the off button is higher than the on button. It's a relay type switch which automatically shuts off if the electricity is interrupted. When electricity is restored, it will not restart unless the button is pressed again. The quick release three spoke lever can be placed on either side of the tool. Just press the button to release. There's a built in bullseye bubble level in the vice base for horizontal placement. This helps keep multiple holes in alignment. The machine and all accessories fit in the plastic carry case. Truly an indispensable tool for adding tees to pipes, either on site or on the bench. Mount the machine to the pipe. Engage the chains in the notches. Check the bubble level to ensure proper alignment. Turn the swivel level screw to tighten the chain. Repeat for the second chain and ensure that both screws are tight. Insert the hole saw into the chuck. Tighten with the chuck key. Add cutting oil to the pilot drill. Start the machine by pressing the on switch. <laughs> 